How does it, how does it feel? I feel pretty good so far. You know, I, uh, I took out the scrimmage. You know, I did an extra uh, day's rest. Let it heal up pretty good. And uh, rehab been, been pretty good. Coach said if you guys were to play tomorrow, they'd have to limit the offense because of the injury. But obviously, you don't play tomorrow. Is, it, is that what you feel like, too? Right now, no, I feel pretty good. I feel great. You know, uh, yesterday, you know, I was, felt like, you know, I took a day off and feel, get back to where I would need to be and, you know, rehab, icing it, taking ibuprofen, I'd be fine. So. Coach said he's had to deal with guys having arm problems like that before and kind of knew what things are going to be like. Does that make you feel kind of confident that, that they can say that? Yeah, of course. You know, if he, he's a hitman, he's been through it all. He had a lot of quarterbacks go through different situations. So. Coming from him, yeah, I feel confident and comfortable. So where I'm, where I'm at right now, I'm fine. Is there any doubt in your mind, Braxton, that you're going to be 100% healthy in three weeks for Navy? 100% right now. It's just it's, it's just out of shape just a little bit. You know, if I, I go out there and throw 80 balls in one practice, which you're not going to do in one game. So it's, uh, it's just sore from throwing, throwing a lot in, in two days. And, you know, just get back to where I need to be. Yeah. What about building rapport with your wide receivers? Are you limited in that respect since they're limiting the volume of your throws? I'll be fine. You know, I, all season, that's what we was doing the whole all season in my rehab. I was with them guys for at least four, four days out of the week. So our timing and situation wise, we get when I get back in there, it's just like, you know, I, I, like I never left. How do they look, the wide receivers? They look solid, man. They look they like they're having fun, catching the ball, running around a little bit, making plays. and. You know, it's ready to go, go out there in the first game and see what they got. It's too bad you don't have any tight ends that can catch passes this year. <laughs> I feel you. <laughs> I got right. a few of them, man. You know, you know my, my man's right right here to my right, and uh very blessed to have him. And uh, Nick and Marcus Ball, they don't step up as well. Braxton, if you had to throw, could you throw right now, or they're just they're being overly conservative with you and not having you throw? How do you feel? No, I feel good. I can throw right now, right now, unless you want to run a route right now. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Start running, boy. <laughs> yeah, I feel good, man. You know, I'll just rest it up. Tomorrow I'll get back to it and uh, feel back to where I need to be. Do you have soreness? I did a couple days ago, but now, you know, I just feel good right now. Braxton, in, Chicago, you, ice in, it. in Chicago, you seemed a little giddy about the weapons you have to play with this year. Now that you got a week under your belt, who's kind of caught your eye out there? Young guy, Jalen Marshall, Mike Thomas. Uh, Corey Smith, them guys, you know, they really get to, y'all really didn't get to see them last year because it was rare shirted and now, you know, be able to see what they got this year and it's going to be a lot, a lot more excitement and, you know, a lot more balls going around to different guys. Do you feel like you'll be more of a distributor last, this year? Last year kind of seemed like Philly was almost a security blanket at times. Yeah, you know, it's a different, different type of offense this year, I feel like, and, you know, we got more guys, that's why we recruit well and, you know, we uh, make sure guys get open. So it's going to be fun.